TSH and its relation to fertility. So TSH, what is TSH? It is a thyroid hormone and it is very important when you are trying to conceive. So it should not be more or it should not be less. So when you get a thyroid test done in a lab basically, the level that they usually give for a cutoff is somewhere around 5. But believe me, if you are, we are planning for pregnancy, means preconception or during the pregnancy phase also, during the first trimester, that is what we are bothered about because we are IVF specialists and we need to, we need to be like bothered about your preconception stage and your first trimester because we don't want miscarriages in the center. So for this, the TSH level has to be between 1 to 2 whenever you get pregnant or you are planning for a conception. There is high chances that when we do the embryo transfer, prior to that, your TSH levels are normal. And as soon as we do the embryo transfer, your implantation happens. The TSH level just goes wild. It goes wild. You can't like decipher that till what level it is going to reach. So in these cases, it is very important that we fertility specialists, we need to have good tie-ups with our endocrinologist and the patient has to understand that we send the doctor to the endocrinologist for further follow-up. Because TSH, high TSH means you're having hypothyroidism is not good for a normal conception. So for fertility, for doing the embryo transfer, we need to have proper control of TSH levels. If the thyroid level is less also, that is also not good. The TSH is less. In these cases, you are suffering from a problem called thyrotoxicosis. So, for a proper embryo transfer to happen, the, the TSH level should be between 1 to 2. So, it is somewhere between 2, it goes. If it is like, like, like somewhere like 0.99 or something, it goes. But if you are having gross elevated TSH, the patient saying that the TSH is, having, is 4, it's normal. But it's not normal for your preconception stage. It's not normal if you want to do a fertility cycle on you. It's not normal, dear, if you are in your first trimester. So you just need to check your TSH levels and your normal is different from the masses normal. Because you are planning for pregnancy, you are going to be a mother, you are going to bear a child and that is very important. So you have to take care of yourself, you have to do your TSH levels off and on during your fertility cycles, it doesn't matter whether you have to get it done every 15 days also. So be prepared for it because TSH is a very important hormone for fertility, for conception as well as for the carrying the pregnancy also. So just take care, maintain your TSH levels, see your doctor routinely. She's going to take care of all your needs. We care about you.